Hello friends, Happy New Year. I am in my home office this week because my kids are off school um, and we're gonna do some fun things the next couple days but I thought I would pop on and just um, get you guys going as far as some easy Popeye ideas from the New Year's. Um, most of these things, except for one, um, you can point and click and order them um, at your desk so you don't have to go sorting out um, things at the store. So I'm going to give it a little bit before I start going into the items so more people can get online. Um, just wanted to let you know that um, this is a great time to stock up on Christmas clearance for um, next year especially wrapping paper. I was at Target last night and there was tons of wrapping paper left and it was 90% um, off and so that is like 30 cents each and you could get you know 30 rolls of it for like ten dollars and you can just um, you know slide it underneath your bed and you'll have your Popeyes ready really inexpensively for next year. So um, Ooh, I'm gonna have my daughters here. Lily, can you grab one of the red glitter bows from up in the cabinet? Um, so I will also let you know that um, I set a goal this year to sell 50 homes. Um, so I am never too busy for any of your Sacramento area referrals. Um, here's another thing that you might wanna um, uh, buy. And I did a Facebook Live when we were in Hobby Lobby, but you'll see a lot of big Christmas bows, and these are awesome to use when you're handing keys to buyers or when you put it on your listing um, for the new buyer uh, when you're handing keys. So here's the big bow. There you go. And there's Lily. There you go. And so those are usually around 10. Um, if you buy them online, they're like $20. But um, with all the Christmas sales, I've been buying them for between three and four dollars. And so um, I have like 30 of them that I just have up in my cabinet and they're really easy to attach to doors. And um, so let me move on to um, some five easy Popeye ideas. I'm going to put a link um, to Popeye ideas and I have made tags for all five of these ideas so you can open up and print them. Um, so number one I will do is, yeah, you can let them in. Um, this is a surprising favorite and you can buy them from a feed store online for about $2.39 and it's one of these bird seed bells. So this is a good one to do in January and February. The tag that I made for it is, have you outgrown your love nest? Maybe it's time to fly the coop and find the home of your dreams. Um, they're usually like six or seven dollars at Walmart, but there's a feed store that I'll link below um, that you can get them for two dollars and thirty nine cents. So I actually went in and ordered those for my January pop by. Um, another sweet one that I do every year is Target in the dollar spot has um, these little Valentine mailboxes and you can fill those with candy, stickers, little treats um, for kids and then I get a black sharpie and I write the family's name on it. Um, the Popeye tag is um, know somebody um, ready to move, um, don't let her them move um, without calling me first and that's on Popeye Ideas. One that I really like to give out is this Zip It tool. And there's a link on Amazon where you can buy several of them at a time. Um, they work out to be around $2 each, but they are um, used to clear uh, drains. And um, I, my dad gave me one of these like five or years ago, and I use it a lot because we have five kids and um, Five, three girls so um, the real estate tag is um, don't something about don't let your friends or family get into a hairy real estate tr um, transaction and that will be linked below as well um, if you're in earthquake country where I'm in California I'm not really in earthquake country in Sacramento but definitely close to the Bay Area and it's always good to have these anyways it's an earthquake um, gas shutoff 
tool, um, that ball point um, valve that's on your gas meter. And this one says, I'm here to protect your real estate investment and ensure a smooth uh, transaction. Okay, a really easy one that you can do, and a lot of people go to um, Bath and Body Works and get those hand soaps. I just put a link where you can buy these um, on Amazon, but it's just a hand soap, especially when people are, you know, in cold and flu season, and it says, if I can give you a hand, please call. Um, another idea to do is to make sure that everybody that you closed a transaction with last year, um, that you're sending out their HUD-1 settlement statements so that it's ready for um, when they prepare their taxes. This year, I'm also going to send it to the whoever was on the other side of the transaction from me as well, um, because you never know, um, you know, that they could potentially become a client down the road. Uh, another good thing to do is to start doing annual reviews. So I spent the last couple of months of last year um, printing out annual reviews, giving clients an idea of what their home was worth, and then dropping it off. And so that is a nice um, way to keep in touch, continue to provide value to clients. Uh, if anyone has any questions, I will stay on for a minute or two. And I'm looking below to see. Okay, no questions. All right, well, you can always message me on Popeye Ideas. Again, I'm never too busy for any of your sacrifices.